Welcome to using Google Drive to save your work in the cloud. By the end of this lesson, you should be able to set up a Google Drive account, upload a file to your Google Drive, and download that file to a different location. You may have heard talk of people saving their work to the cloud. All this means is that they're saving their work to a remote hard drive that they access over the internet. This is what Google Drive is. It is disk space on a remote hard drive that you can access from anywhere you have internet access. You can think of it as a flash drive that's stored on the internet. This can be useful if you forgot to bring your flash drive with you to the library, or you have work that won't fit on your flash drive. The first thing we need to do is go to the Google website by typing into our address bar www.google.com and hitting enter. In order to use Google Drive, you must first sign into your Google account. Sign in is in the upper right. If you have a Gmail account, then you can just use that username to log in. The username would be your Gmail email address and email password. If you do not have a Google account, then click on Sign Up in the upper right hand side of the screen. Fill out all the information on this screen, then click Next Step. For this example, I will just create a random account with random information. Random, random, southwest, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, birthday, just a random day. Okay, type in the verification, J-O-H-N-M-A-Y-E-D-E-F. Okay, agree to the privacy policy, click next step. And now you have created a Google account. Now remember this username and password, we're going to need it later to log back into our account. It would be a good idea to write it down somewhere. Okay, go to the choices at the top of the screen and choose Drive. You're now in your Google Drive account. It's currently empty. In order to add information to this account, you need to upload a file. The red button with the white up arrow and a line under it is the Upload button. Click on it, and it will ask you if you want to upload files or folders. For this example, let's upload a file. Click on the Upload button, click on Files, and an Open dialog box will appear. We now need to choose the file we want to upload to our Google Drive. I will choose a Word file I have saved on the desktop. I'll click on Desktop, and as you can see, there's only one Word file. I will click on it, and I will now click Open. When the upload is complete, it will say uploaded, and it says upload complete at the top of this box. I now see the file is in a list on the page, test file for Google account .docx. Let's click on the checks box beside it, and now we can see what options we have to manipulate this file. Click on more in the top near the middle. As you can see there are many options but for our purposes all I want to do is download the file so I'll click on download. A save as dialog box comes up asking me where I want to save my file to. I will save it to my flash drive. In this case it's removable disk E and I will click on save. 
we have now uploaded a file to a Google Drive account and then downloaded it to a new location. Let's start from the beginning once for practice. Close your browser. Open the browser back up. Go to www.google.com now in the middle you should see drive if you don't see it it might be in more but we see it in the middle of the screen click on drive we're still signed in let's sign out go to the upper right click on your username sign out okay now we want to sign in use the username we created earlier Mine was southwest123456678 at gmail, but whatever yours was, put it in. Now put in your password. And click sign in. We now see the file that we uploaded earlier. Click on the checkbox to the left of the file. Click on more in the upper middle. Click on download. I'm going to choose to download it into documents. And I'm going to click save. And we have retrieved our file. We can now save this file on any computer that has internet access that will allow us to log into our Google Drive account. Before we end our lesson, let's go over the key terms that we learned. Upload. Uploading a file is the process of saving a file to a remote location on the internet. You can think of it like this. When you download a file, you bring it down from the internet to your computer, but when you upload a file, you put it up onto the internet from your computer. The cloud. The cloud refers to a remote web storage service which allows you to save your data on a web server and access it at any time you have access to an internet connection. Google Drive. This is a service provided by Google where they save your files online and give you access to them anywhere you can log into your Google account. In this lesson we learned how to create a Google Drive account, how to log into that account, how to upload a file onto this account, and how to download a file from this account to a different location. I hope you learned something, and as always, if you have any more questions, please email me at fmatthews at southwest.tn.edu.